Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to uh, continue these uh, steps uh, for the VR project design. So we will com complete it today. So in my last and previous uh, videos, I have completed uh, the uh, most of the uh, steps, which is uh, heat load calculation and then um, uh, divide the building into zone for the VRF system. In case of uh, high rise and multi story building, you have to divide the uh, building into zone and then you have to place the indoor and outdoor which we have done and do the piping layout for uh, from indoor to outdoor as per the zone so we have done here the indoor uh, placement of indoor and outdoor and uh, <coughs> the piping uh, layout from indoor to outdoor so next step uh, do the equipment selection for outdoor and indoor and also pipe sizing using software so Toshiba uh, using, uh, using Toshiba software I have uh, done the equipment selection as well as pipe sizing so next step uh, is balance which is second number uh, which is uh, calculate the free shear calculation for each space then FHU design and ducting layout then next uh, and last uh, step will be prepare the shop drawing with the equipment schedule <coughs> So let us continue with this second step which is fresh air calculation so i and there is one uh, sheet here you can see so let me delete all these okay let me delete delete all these okay <coughs> so this is the uh, one uh, sheet for uh, fresh air calculation so here you can see the floor so um, our floor is the ground floor so let us uh, start from here okay so our uh, floor is ground floor and next is spaces so spaces you can see here the number of spaces is given which is classroom one two three then lobby and computer room so better to go this and uh, this equipment schedule and you can see here the classroom one two three and computer room etc so just copied uh, just to save the time copy from there and paste it here and then area in square feet we need so go to this equipment selection and you can see here the area is given in a square feet just copy from here and paste it here okay here you go now uh, sorry area in a square feet here is in a square meter so we need in a square feet okay if you want to a square meter so what you will do just divide this area with uh, 10.76 okay so you will get here sorry just uh, divide this with uh, 10.76 okay here so in a square meter you can got the area and here you can make it zero so this is in a square meter and this is in a square feet now next uh, we need cfm per square feet number of people and cfm per person and then there is, here is one formula which is uh, for fresh air calculation cfm per, uh, CFM, uh, per person into number of people plus cfm per square feet into area in a square feet so cfm per square feet uh, you can uh, calculate from the isra uh, data book so here is the table number 6.1 and which is ASRAE uh, 62.1 ventilation standard 62.1 2007 so here is the minimum ventilation rate in breathing zone here you can see the occupancy category and here is given the people outdoor air and the area then here is uh, the occupant density is given so we need for the classroom which is ages 9 plus uh, 9 plus <coughs> so for this one uh, you can see uh, the cfm per person is 10 given and for computer lab lab uh, 10 as well and here is the lobby for 7.5 so just go here and cfm per square feet 10 just enter here 10 10 and then computer room 10 as well and here is the 7.5 cfm per square feet <coughs> sorry cfm per square feet is 0 0.12 here <coughs> cfm per square feet 0 0.12 okay and here is 0 0.06 sorry cfm per square feet 0 0.12 okay 
same value is copied and here is 0 0.06 for the lobby number of people so number of people cfm per person first we uh, uh, calculate and take from this table so cfm per person you can see here this is the cfm per person so in this column you have to look for the cfm so per person 10 cfm for the classroom and computer lab and the lobby 7.5 so just go to these sheets and here you can place 10 10 and then 7.5 okay so sorry here is also 10 and here is 7.5 now number of people so for uh, uh, here you can see the number of people which is called occupant density so for 1000 square feet uh, classroom is 9 plus 35 uh, people is there <clears throat> so our area is 876 square feet so how to calculate just uh, apply the formula here equal to then area into 1000 sorry area into 35 for 1000 square feet 35 people so for 876 square feet how much people so you have to multiply with this area into 35 divided by 1000 you will get here the number of people for 876 square feet so now you have to drag this then this uh, formula will be copied in each uh, cell here you can see <coughs> now you can uh, double click here and you can see here this is already applied formula here to calculate the fresh air cfm which is here h5 g5 h5 is nothing but uh, this is the cfm per person into g5 g5 is number of people plus cfm f5 f5 is cfm per square feet here is the five row and f is the column and then into e5 so e5 is the e5 e row and a five column so area so total cfm we got here 1607 cfm okay so just save this and uh, i hope you guys learn how to calculate the fresh air and then in the next videos we will do the phrase fh design so i hope you guys learn something from this video if you learn something from this video please do subscribe my channel and uh, just like and share my video so thank you for watching my video thank you bye bye